Abukir is a big island located west from Ankrachnum and the Darama Desert. It's big, full of interesting quests, places and hunting spots. In this video I want to cover one of its hunting spots, the Dragon Lair in the Eastern Mountains. Abukir can be separated into the two parts. We can talk about south and north. You arrive in the city, in the southern area. The only way north leads through mountains, through small passage, locked by a doors. Without a key, you won't get through. Dragon Saldo are located in the south. All special items are good to have while hunting this specific dragon lair. Except obvious ones, there are a few. Pick hole to dig into the deeper area of the spawn. Destroy fields because of the dragon lords in the area. And also it's nice to have the key 7000. The spawn is located fairly close to the doors and just behind them you can find the royal mailbox from where you can send your loot home. You can also drag it, but it's a pretty long way, so keep that in mind. Away from the is following, Abukir just as Fergula might confuse the newcomers, but it gets very intuitive after a few visits. If you won't get lost, which you shouldn't, you won't meet anything stronger than few stone golems. And here is the map version. That's the local depot. You enter the center of the city, you cross the bridge separating city to west and east, and then you make your way to this little mountain. Few steps this way and you enter the Sanafa desert. Now stick close to the mountain side and take this long walk east. Enter the mountain, some stone golems here, two floors up and this way. Oh, chest below you is a quest for golden legs. Good luck with this one. North, some stone golems here again, and you arrived, Dragon Lair is just below you. Alright, let's get into the spawn now. This is where you should put your letter. It's hard to compare this place to any other lair. It's a mix of red and green dragons, and hunting one means hunting the other one too. You should reach higher experts compared to, for example, the North Dragon Lair or Idron, the most common two but less than poison. On the other hand, you will do your task faster at these other places, since they are focused on one kind of dragon mainly. You also won't be able to fully utilize your summons since the whole hunting spot is scattered around few separate floors, both under and above the ground. It's a good alternative though, very viable for all the vocations, easy to take dragons one by one, and also a fine place to keep them on distance. Let's get into the specifics. You enter the spawn at the red circle here. There are four single dragons and one lord at this floor. You can see two more dragons and dragon lords on the right, but there is a lava where the blue line is. You cannot cross it, but if one of the beasts will come too close to the edge, it can shoot you through it, so keep that in mind. The purple circle will take you one floor higher, a single dragon lord spawn. The blue circle, on the other hand, will lead you deeper into the lair. The blue circle is where you enter. Dragon Lord will most likely welcome you right away. There are a total 4 dragons and 2 dragon lords at this floor. The red circle will take you upstairs and you will end up on the other side of the lava. 2 dragons of each kind, 4 in total. This room might be tricky since it's easy to end up with 2 dragons at your chest at the same time. You can use the lava to shoot them through and keep them far. If you, although prefer the melee combat, keep yourself as close to the stairs as possible. Blue circle will take you one floor higher, to a single red dragon spawn. Going back to the main ground, there is one more green circle. It will take you to another single dragon lord spawn. Let's take a look underground now. By using shovel at the purple square, you will end up here. Southwest from the entrance are two dragon lords, quite close to each other. There are two more of those and one dragon here. Another green circle here will take you deeper underground. It's a room with two dragon lords. You can use your pick inside the red circle and you will go even deeper. 
now this floor might get a bit intense now so be careful when you go down you are most likely to be welcomed by two red and one green dragon the floor is fairly small the blue line represents the lava again you can't walk through it but dragons will easily shoot you through it you can do the same to them there are five lords and three green dragons in this part of the cave to summarize there are 33 dragons in total 14 green and 19 dragon lords the last thing the royal mailbox from the spawn entrance follow the blue line then climb up here the green circle represents the door and the blue square is the mailbox oh ps the box down here is not a quest it's just a box